From James Field on Saturday in the District 7 Legion Baseball Championship, Auburn Post 84 taking on Grass Valley. It'll be a monumental day for that man, Rad Thomas. In the first inning, Jake Miller gets Post 84 on the board here with an RBI single. This makes it 2 0 in the first inning. 484 as they look to get on the board early and quickly against Grass Valley. With Thomas on the mound, he gets out of this one in the second inning. Keeps the run going for post 84, still up two nothing before Jake Bowl. He'll come up with an RBI single in the third. Auburn now up four nothing as two runs score on that one. Auburn looking to end the championship early on as the players, well, yeah, they were having a little fun with the YMCA and then getting serious in the defense. 5-4-3 double play start by Ray Miller to Jake Buell. That'll end a little run for Grass Valley still through five innings. Thomas had given up walks, hits batters, errors, but no hits in this one so far as they continue. But here, Grass Valley, despite not having a hit through six innings, still scored a run. We go to the bottom of the six, Jordan Wood. He gets on the board, an RBI single before Ray Henry goes to the fence on this one. A two-run double would give Auburn a 8-1 lead before Grass Valley would score two runs in the top of the seventh inning. But here on the last out, a ground out to shortstop. It's a no-hitter for Rad Thomas. He strikes out seven, gives up five walks. Gets the victory and the dog pile. Congratulations to Rad Thomas after throwing his first career no hitter post 84, wins the Disc 7 championship and advances to Red Bluff. I mean, honestly, it feels great just because my defense was backing me up, so that felt good. I mean, I know the walks weren't that great, but at the same time, still worked out. Um, I like to, well, you can't see the score, but I like to get rid of those three runs, but I mean, it was still pretty cool. We got the W, so that was good. Very impressive. Uh, you know, every time Rad gets on the mound, something exciting could happen. Uh, the guy's got electric stuff. Uh, although he's uh, a little wild at times, so we're, we're working with him every day on something. And, uh, and that's why he does hit a few batters, because we're still letting him throw his way, and we're still throwing inside. And that's uh, everything we can do to make him successful. Uh, I'm pretty confident. I'd say that uh, it's, team's going to need to play a pretty good game to beat us. We're pretty confident. We've been playing good lately, and uh, uh, it's going to take a good team to beat us, I believe. From James Field for the Auburn Journal, I'm Trevor Horn.